we were on our way to Lethbridge, and I thought I'd show you some of the parks that they had in town there. There were some pretty good sights. First we had to go through this beautiful prairie, and then after that we decided to stop for lunch at a Mexican restaurant, which was pretty good, nice food, lovely meal. So the first park here is the Henderson Lake Park, which is in the central area of Lethbridge. Well worth the time, it's got a beautiful walkway around the lake here, as well as some other attractions, bridges, such as that. Very well worth it, lots of waterfall, as you'll see in the next area here, which is the Nika Yauku Japanese Garden. And some, even some, I think that's a regatta, but I'm not sure. But here's the Nika Yoku Japanese Garden, which is just off to the side of Henderson Lake Park. It's got some beautiful views. I'll link uh, another video that I did on this. This place had lots of ducks, so if you love ducks, there's plenty there to see. Very relaxing, very well worth it. So the next area we went down to was where the Lethbridge High Level Bridge is and it was built in 1909 and is said to be the largest railway structure in Canada. And this guy here we found along the path, this is a Sphinx Hawk Moth if you're interested. We tried to get a size comparison to this guy but he was moving around pretty good. Uh, this park is the um, Lethbridge Nature Reserve along the Old Man River. And uh, some other views here of the old bridge. You can see some old telegraph poles going through here. The answer is? Fair amount actually, 101,482. Hmm. As assessed during the 2019 municipal census. I see. Yeah, that explains why it has that city feel. Mm -hmm. We were wondering what the population of Lethbridge was there, and because uh, we were noticing that it had very city-like feel to it. And yeah, the population is decent size. Yeah, then we found these deer in the bush here. this close. It was quite nice. That was a dive bombing by a bird, by the way. I'm not sure why, but it might be explained in the next clip here. And, and once he got sick of us, they took off. But yeah, this little chickadee, she put her hand out just to see if it would land on her hand. But she didn't have any nuts. So they were kind of like, what is this? Some views of the Old Man River there. But yeah, again, a very worthwhile trip to make to this nature reserve as well. As you can see, we weren't expecting to see deer, and there was a lot of wildlife there. There's a very quick little video just showing you some parks around the city that we found. Hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for coming over.